Converting apt to Excel using Python can be a bit tricky, as not inherently structured like Excel files. However, you can extract data from apt and format it into a structure that can be saved as an Excel file. While Pipe2 is a powerful library for reading files, it is primarily used for extracting text and metadata from documents. For more complex tasks like extracting tabular data, libraries like Pandas and Tabulopi may be more suitable. In this tutorial, I will show you how to extract text from apt using Pipe2 and then write that data to an Excel file using Pandas. Prerequisites make sure you have the necessary libraries installed. You can install them using pip bash pip install pipe2 pandas open pixel step 1 extract text from t using pipe2 first. We will use pipe2 to read the apt file and extract text from it. Here's how to do that python import pipe2 diff extract text from path path text with open path or as father pipe2. Reader pfeff file for page in reader pages text page extract text and extract text from each page return text example usage path your file pf, replace with your pfeff file path pf, text extract text from pfeff tanitid For this example, Let's assume our contains tabular data where each line represents a row and values are separated by commas. Here's how you can process it. Python import pandas as edf process text to data frame text lines text strip. Split in data line split for line in lines split each line into a listed fit. Data frame data warm. Columns data zero, assuming the first row is the header returned. Example usage to process text to data frame. Text printed. Print the data frame. Step three, save data frame to Excel. Now that we have our data frame, we can easily save it as an Excel file. Conclusion This tutorial demonstrated how to convert apt file to an Excel file using Python, Pipe2, and Pandas. While this approach works well for simple text extraction, remember that complex layouts may require more sophisticated methods and libraries, such as tabula p or plumber, especially when dealing with structured data.